What's up, everybody? How you doing? We're back. And this is why you should choose Interceptor. And I'm showing you all the reasons right in the beginning of the fucking video. What a nice guy. No, I'm kidding. Um, this is Interceptor. If you're looking at an MMO style class, this is going to be your up close and personal high damage, high agility, whatever you want to call it. Uh, Interceptor has a lot of really unique features uh, that I find to be incredible. The kit's really good and you get to be melee focused, which unlike a lot of the other classes where your focus is on abilities and guns, uh, your melee really does truly stand out on Interceptor. You get to spam it as much as you want and you get to look like a super cool ninja. In addition, and you probably saw this uh, right in the beginning, you acquire auras when you set off combos with your melee so after you've gotten your melee to go off you have your ice aura here or you can do flame war or whatever and this allows you to continuously freeze proc and detonate enemies with your blades which is actually a really cool uh skill set in addition to that i know what you're thinking well wait there's more <laughs> Uh, you have really cool kit that involves your ability to debuff bosses. Now, you've probably seen some huge damage numbers from other, you know, pieces of content or other streams that you've seen where you're like, wow, how do they do that much damage to the boss? It was probably a combination of the Ranger's gun damage increase skill and this fella right here, the Interceptor, uh, tossing out the damage beacon. So, if you're looking for a class that you know, has three mid-air dodges or a, tr a triple, double, triple, triple, double, triple jump. Um, or you're looking for something where you can get up, up close and personal, dive in and out of combat uh, without too much struggle, too much difficulty, and be the person that starts the chain of combos. You're going to want to play Interceptor. Uh, if you like high-speed combat, if when you played uh, or saw the first demo for Anthem, you were like, shit, I want to fly around and whip ass and just have this incredibly up close and personal combat style, yikes, against all these other enemies, then this is it, Chief. In addition to all of this, okay, you're all pretty sick too. Uh, you get to chain a whole bunch of combat and leave shadows behind. Uh, that stalk all of your other enemies doing continuous damage to them so you can run through a whole bunch of people leaving auras of yourself continuously attacking those enemies until they're dead i'm a huge fan of interceptor it's probably going to be maybe my secondary focus once the game comes out i can't recommend this enough if you have seen gameplay of anthem and you thought oh well that looks boring and slow uh the gameplay with you know the Colossus or even with the storm can feel a little plotting at times because that's how those classes work. They're a little bit slower than uh, you would expect. And if you're looking for a high velocity gameplay, it doesn't really come down to the game. It comes down to which javelin you're using. If you want to go fast, OK, you're going to want to use the interceptor. This And like this, this is great. Like you, what is better than chain freezing and blowing people up? I don't know nothing bob thanks jim so there you go if you're a fan of up close and personal combat quick and and violent gameplay i highly recommend the interceptor and that's why you should choose the interceptor and i'll talk to you next time peace